Hi, my name is Peter Schiffer and I'm one of the faculty here at the Academy of Art University. It's an exciting day. We're here at the Bronze Foundry and we're about to pour uh, bronze, molten bronze, into this cup. The bronze casting process is many different steps and we start off with first making a sculpture. In this case, these sculptures were made by students like you by hand. Then there's a gating process where um, wax sprues are connected to the sculpture and a cup is put on there. Then there's 10 dips of this ceramic shell that is like a plaster that builds up around the outside of the sculpture and the cup. This cup represents two students' artworks. These are actually shells from the Sculpture One students. Some of the Sculpture Two students and actually some of the other advanced graduate students are all pouring their bronzes today. It's an old art form. We do it very similar to the way the Greeks did it back in the day, although we have some more contemporary technology as well. But basically, liquid bronze at 2,000 degrees, molten hot bronze, will be poured into this. This is a, an ingot of bronze. It's about 10 or 15 pounds. One pound of wax equals about 10 pounds of bronze. And uh, th these ingots, just like gold bars, this is a bronze bar, um, will be melted into the crucible that will be filmed here in a little bit. And that will become molten at about 2,000 degrees. Once the bronze cools, we'll break this shell off and you'll see a bronze sculpture inside there. It'll be connected with gates and sprues that'll have to be cut off. But ultimately, there'll be a beautiful bronze sculpture at the end. The amazing thing is that the bronze goes from 2,000 degrees to a few hundred degrees in just a matter of minutes and it becomes hard very quickly. I've been doing this for decades. I love it so much. It's one of the most fun things because you can make something by hand that's really organic and then it becomes permanent in metal in a matter of minutes.